welcome. Today, we are gonna make a grapevine out of a paper towel, paint, scrap cardboard, paper, and a green marker. This activity is super fun because you get to be very creative with making vines and then painting grapes. First, you're gonna start out with making some vines because vines are super fun and the kids can get super creative with how they make their squiggly lines. Great vines wrap around all over the place. So I'm just gonna make some curvy lines. Keep on going and filling my page with those curvy lines. Eventually we'll go back and add some leaves once we know where the grapes are. Now that you've done that, we are going to add some paint onto purple paint. Grapes are also green and red and all other colors we want, but I'm choosing purple because that is my favorite color. I have a little bit of purple paint on to my cardboard. And from there, I'm going to grab my paper towel roll and I am going to dip it into the paint. And so we're going to get those nice round edges. Now you don't have to worry about the paper towel being perfectly round. Actually, mine's kind of oval in shape and that's great because grapes come in perfectly round and oval and all sorts of sizes. So I'm going to blot it and see if I have enough paint on there because those are going to be the shapes of the grapes. A little bit more paint. So there we go. Now it's time to add my grapes. I'm going to make sure that at least one tip is on the vine when I press it down. And then I'm going to press another one down. I'm going to keep on doing that until I run out of paint and then I'm going to add more paint in. Here, there, there. And I'm just going to keep on pressing my grapes on. All over my vines. Now that I've added grape vines onto my vine, I'm going to go back and see if there's any additional ones I need to make those shapes with. Now you can go back and paint inside those grapes if you want. Or you can leave it open like this. I think it looks kind of fun leaving it open like this. But there's many opportunities. Now I'm going to take my marker and I'm going to go back and I'm going to add some leaves in. And it's okay if leaves are on top of some of the grapes for the vines because you know what? These vines grow all the place. Once you feel like your grapevine is good enough, you can be done. And like I said, if you wanted to extend this activity out a little bit longer, you could get a paintbrush and you could paint the insides of the grapes. Uh, it just depends on the attention span of the children you're working with. Let's see you at the next adventure.